Okay, so let's walk you through the whole process of getting an Aquitas license and getting started. So from the very beginning, you're gonna to wanna to buy your license. So you can come down here and you pick the license that you want. And you're gonna buy it now. View your cart and proceed to check out. Check that you've read the terms and conditions and place your order. All right, and then you'll send the Bitcoin and when you're done, you'll get an email. So let's jump to that. All right, so you've processed your order. We've sent the payment, we've sent you a bunch of emails and you'll see there's kind of a group of three down here. Those are all dealing with your account on the Aquitas website. And then when the license actually gets processed, we'll send you a, a note. And the note is the one that's gonna contain your your license information. So you can see here, we've got a license key and we have the contact form and we have the Discord that you need to join in order to get your, get your actual software and get into the Discord channels. So let's go ahead and do that now. We'll accept the invite. And because I already have the Discord app, it wants to say, hey, you, you can go to your app, but we'll use the web version because a little easier. Okay, cool. So here we are, and you get these four channels. This is what everybody sees when they come to our server uh, without without a license. And you'll see that VIP members have you know a bot to talk to, and pretty much everybody else is going to click on this guy. Okay, so you can click on that, and you just send him a message. You got to say license. There it goes, a little, little delayed there. Okay, so he wants my license key. All right, well, let's do that. Let's grab the key. There you go. Okay, now it wants the email. This is the email you use to sign up on our site. Okay, so now it's validated me. That's what you wanna see. And then we come over to the channels and you can see there's now a lot more available on the left. If you're professional level, you'll get professional plus verified. If you're just a verified user, uh, you'll see, you know, all of this here. All right, so now we have to get the software, right? So let's go over to the builds channel. And you can see this is the list of all of our builds. Scroll down to the bottom, you'll find the latest one. Let's click it and download it. This process will be slightly different depending on the OS that you're on. I'm on Linux, so that's what we're gonna see. And I'll probably append to this video later with a Mac version and a Windows version to, to show you the slight differences there. Okay, so there we go. All right, let's go ahead and switch to what it looks like to install. All right, so this is gonna look slightly different, but I am in Linux and I'm in the directory where I've downloaded the, the, the files, okay? And I can check that and see that we have, you know, the, all, the, all the Aquitas files in there. If you're in Windows, you're probably gonna to wanna to double click on that file when it shows up in your window. Uh, and if you're on a Mac, there's a Mac start command that will open it up for you. And if you're on a Linux terminal or desktop, you're gonna to wanna to use a startup script, so. Let's do that. That's fine. Once you see the Aquitas started, that's what you want. So let's go ahead and go open the browser and we'll continue setup from there. All right, so you can see here, I've opened a web browser and I've pointed it to the local host because I'm running this machine locally. Uh, that's probably okay for most people just starting out. Otherwise, uh, you're gonna have to change this part to the IP address or the DNS name you know, of the instance where the server is running. So we're gonna to have to put in the, all the information that we need, uh, your first name, last name, and email address, and the license key. All of this is the stuff that you used when you set up. Okay, and then it's gonna verify that these are all correct when I hit next. 
and it takes us to the next screen. So we're going to use Binance. You can call it whatever you want. Okay, and that's going to want the API keys that you set up. If you need help with that, there is a separate video that shows you exactly how to get those keys from Binance. So let's go ahead and put those in. And be careful. Sometimes I've had people have issues where there was a space at the beginning, you know, if it gets invalidated. So I usually just kind of click on there and make sure there's no spaces. Um, and then when we're hit done, we hit done. And it's going to validate those keys are good keys. And then once you have success, that's it. You're in. So you've got your exchanges. Uh, you have to add a starting capital because that's how the paper trading works. And you can put whatever you want, you know, one Bitcoin. And we'll save that and you are ready to go. You can go into your back testing and start playing around with all of the uh, cool stuff in Aquitas. Hopefully that helped. If you have any more questions, just go ahead and leave us a message in Discord or you know, via the, um, the contact us on the website.